This content is intended for educational purposes only. Unauthorized use of these techniques is illegal. Please act responsibly. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to reveal the latest techniques hackers are using to gain access to anyone's Gmail account, and most importantly, how you can protect yourself. But before we begin, this video is strictly for educational purposes only. Do not use this information for any illegal activity. Now, let's get started. For this tutorial, we'll be using a powerful tool known as Fisher, one of the most commonly used tools in phishing attacks today. Let's walk through how it works. As you can see in the terminal, there are multiple website templates available like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and so on, each designed to mimic popular platforms. Hackers often use these templates to trick users into giving up their login credentials. For this demonstration, I'm selecting template number 3, which is specifically designed to target Gmail accounts. Now, we move to the next stage, this is where a hacker selects the type of phishing page the victim will see on their screen. In this case, I'm choosing the new Gmail login interface, which looks nearly identical to the real thing. Finally, we need to choose the server to host the fake login page. Since this is just a demonstration and not an actual attack, I'll be selecting localhost, which is option number one. Without custom port, now it's prompting me to send this fake login page to the target. But for this demonstration, I'll just copy the link and open it in my own browser to show you exactly how it looks. And wow, the moment I open the page, you can see the terminal instantly detects a connection. The fake Gmail login page is almost identical to the real one, with a field to enter both your email and password. Now, just as an example, I'll type in linuxguy at gmail.com and use a random password like, password at 222. Let's see what shows up in the terminal. Now, let's click on the sign in button. As you can see, the moment the victim hits submit, their email and password are instantly captured and displayed in the attacker's terminal. What's even more dangerous? After stealing the credentials, the hacker can automatically redirect the victim to the real Gmail website, making everything seem normal, and the victim may never realize they've been hacked. This is exactly what makes phishing attacks so dangerous, especially when the fake page is nearly identical to the real one. So how can you protect yourself from this kind of attack? Here are some important tips. Always check the URL. Phishing pages often have suspicious or unusual links. Enable two-factor authentication, 2FA, even if your password is stolen, the attacker still needs a second code. Avoid clicking on links from unknown sources, especially in emails or DMs. Use a password manager, it won't autofill on fake pages. Stay updated with the latest phishing trends, Awareness is your first line of defense. Quick disclaimer before we end this video. This content is created strictly for educational purposes only. It does not hack or compromise anyone's Gmail account. Everything shown was purely for demonstration and awareness, to help you understand how these attacks work, so you can better protect yourself. By staying alert and cautious, you can avoid falling victim to attacks like this. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon to stay ahead in cybersecurity. Check out more videos here to keep your knowledge sharp.